Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I know I've been gone for a long time. I have had flu number two. I've had two flus, two colds in the space of a, of a month. So that is why I am late for this. I am also <laughs> backed up with readings that I've missed because of me being ill. And also I've missed the October predictions, which either I'll probably do them or I might do a mid-monthly instead of just a monthly okay guys so i do apologize for that but i'm trying to get back on track this is just a quick message for you guys just to give you a bit of guidance so if you want to carry on watching then please do we have the pick a card for your angel message we have the crystal angel cards and we have some tarot under there as well this is just a quick message to help you in general life so this could be about love money work just life in general so we have group number one group number two and group number three if you'd like to choose your message now then we'll just get started so let's get started with group number one Hello group number one, let's get started with your reading. So your angel message today, you have make time for self-care. Taking care of yourself is essential right now. And then we have the strength card. So this pretty much is showing me that you need to look after yourself and that my brightness is really high. Um, <laughs> you need to work on your strength, okay? Being, being strong within yourself. There's quite a lot of negativity around you possibly. Could be to do with people, money, work, life, just in general, you could be a bit sad about your love life, anything like that. I feel like there's just an energy of being really, really strong right now and working on that, okay? Kyanite could also be a very particular crystal. So if you want to look that crystal up, see what the properties are and if you may need it. Um, I do sense that there's could be a Leo around you as well if there's somebody who is kind of messing you around or a Leo could have come back from the past. You could, your mind I feel like is focused a lot on uh, being strong and I feel like you kind of put yourself down, you think I'm not strong enough, why can't I get through this, I don't know if I can get through this and you can get through this, okay, you can really do it. You really need to take care of yourself in any way that's possible. So it could be taking a bath, could be going for a run, dancing, anything like that. This energy at the moment is so stagnant, guys, with this Libra new moon. Obviously, this, this message is timeless, but right now, the Libra new moon is so stagnant, I feel like, for my life in any way. So if you guys are feeling like things are stagnant, really, really look after yourself. Look after that part of you that's just so, like, willing, like, wanting change and everything like that. And I feel like um, even moving your body will help shift that energy, okay? So I really hope this resonated for you guys. Um, you could also be a Leo watching this as well. Thank you so much for watching. If this resonated, please let me know down below. And I will be I will be back soon with, a, um, with October readings, but they may be middle monthly instead of monthly. So thank you so much for being patient with me. Love you guys so much. And happy birthday to all Scorpios this month as well. And I'll speak to you very soon. Hi guys. Hello group number two. Let's get started with your quick crystal angel message. We have deep emotional healing, Azurite. Your heart is ready to heal from past experiences and you are willing to devote time and energy towards therapeutic care. We then have clearing negativity. Release negativity from within and around you, okay? And then from the tarot, we have the magician. So basically there's a new start coming for you right now. And because this new start is happening, you're needing to let go of a lot of old shit that needs to <laughs> needs to go, okay? So basically, I'm saying shit because it's very deep stuff. Um, basically, this could be to do with a certain person. This could be to do with a certain situation. Could even be a, um, what's it, like a law, um, like an official um, court case sort of thing. So that could be to do with that. I do sense some people could be also going through divorce if you're watching this. So just to let you know that this is, this is happening and it's and basically it's, as I said, when the magician is happening, it's like things are shifting and changing and you will get through this, uh, similar to group number one. And I feel like you're conjuring up a nice new start for yourself. So group number two, you're doing really, really well. Things may seem negative right now, but you're really healing yourself. And just to know that this new start is right around the corner, okay? I'm seeing about a month or two, even, even, even like a couple of weeks. After this Libra energy, I feel like you'll really manifest this. Even in the Libra energy, you may even manifest this, okay? Um, all the timing is different for you guys. And funnily enough, group number one got strength card, which also has an infinity sign above the head. So if that means something to you, then uh, that is the message for you, okay? Also, this is number one. So this is basically you starting a new start and a new um, start coming in for you. So absolutely amazing, guys. So if you're feeling negative and things aren't moving, just know that they will move very, very soon, okay? So just keep hopeful. You're doing a really, really good job. Give yourself a pat on the back. Give yourself a nice hug, <laughs> okay? And I'll speak to you very soon. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I will be back with uh, October readings very soon. I will be back possibly with mid-monthlies. I don't think you guys would want to watch October monthlies because they're a bit late. But, you know, maybe it depends how fast I can get them out. 
Um, thank you so much for watching, guys. If you'd like to subscribe, please feel free. I also do private readings, so if you'd like to get one of those, all the information is down below, and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye, guys. Hello, group number three. Let's get started with your reading for your crystal angel message. You have busy times and multitasking, calcite. Take charge of your schedule during this busy time and honestly assess your underlying reasons for being busy, okay? And then we also have the star. I love this like color combination, like with the yellow and the blue, the teal, that's so pretty. And then we also have the nine of pentacles. So you guys are very, very busy at the moment. If you're not busy right now, you will be. You've got some gorgeous energy surrounding you. I'm seeing like this aura is actually around you. Like you've got a really nice light. I feel like you're glowing. Like if you don't feel like you're glowing, you will be going very soon because I feel like you're really gonna find your life purpose or you have found your life purpose and you're really like delving into it right now. If you're not really looking for your life purpose and you really kind of feel like that's sorted or you want to do something new, I feel like starting a new hobby or just doing something that really lights you up would be really, really good for you. Um, your life purpose also can actually bring you towards a life partner if that's what you're looking for, so that will help as well. And also, you guys, um, Busy Times basically is telling you to look after yourself as well. And you need to kind of, it says, take charge of your schedule during this busy time. So maybe you're feeling a little bit scattered, um... Maybe you're feeling like there's a little bit of stress, so just kind of work on that. And for, for a lot of you single gut, single people out there who is watching this reading, this is your energy right here. You're really enveloped in that energy and you're really embracing who you are. You're embracing your singleness, which is absolutely stunning. And you're basically, there is a lot of good goodness coming towards you. If you're not single, this is you just kind of working on yourself, working on your energy, kind of being your feminine energy. Obviously, man or woman, doesn't matter. You're being in that energy, very empowering. Um, could even be masculine energy, but I'm seeing it's more feminine, very light. Um, and I'm seeing something really, really good coming towards you because you're really working yourself. You're manifesting something amazing coming in. And the busyness is really, really good. So uh, keep on top of it, guys. And you're doing a really amazing job. So um, that's your message for today. So thank you so much for watching. Um, I will be coming out probably with mid-monthlies for October. I probably won't be able to fit in the actual October monthlies anymore because I'm a bit behind because I've been ill. So I really hope you guys can forgive me for that. And I was really excited to do an October readings as well because my birthday's in October. I'm a Scorpio. My birthday's on Halloween. So I was hoping that, but hopefully we can do mid-monthlies if that's what you want to see, guys. So thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to subscribe, please feel free. And if you want a private reading, then please feel free. All the information is down below. And I'll speak to you very soon. Love you lots. Bye.